Hey everybody, it's Lon Seidman. The war is over. Amazon and Google have made peace. And now you can get Amazon Prime Video on your Chromecast. And you can also get YouTube on your Amazon Fire TV. And I thought I would show you how it is all working now. On the back of this monitor, we have a Chromecast and Fire TV plugged in and peacefully coexisting. And we're going to take a look at how everything works on both of these devices in just a second. But I do want to let you know in the interest of full disclosure that everything in this video I paid for with my own funds, including the devices plugged into the back of this monitor. All the opinions you're about to hear are my own. Nobody is paying for this review, nor has anyone reviewed or approved what you're about to see before it was uploaded. And I'm also paying for those Prime and YouTube premium subscriptions as well. So let's get into it now and see how it all works. All right, so we're gonna kick things off with Amazon Prime Video on Chromecast. And if you look in the lower right-hand corner of my iPhone screen, you can see that we've got now a Chromecast icon. It's very much front and center here and I've got my Chromecast booted up on this display. And if I go ahead and just tap on that and select my yellow Chromecast here, uh, the Chromecast will switch over to the Amazon mode. Uh, we've got Prime Video there at the bottom. We're ready to cast, and I'm going to take a look at uh, one of my favorite shows here, The Expanse, and we'll just start resuming uh, the first episode here and get that going. And sure enough, it is working now, so we can finally uh, get our Amazon Prime Video on our Chromecast, and this will work also on Android in the same way. It does take a second for it to spin up here, but there we go. The intro is running and everything is good. I'm not seeing anything else here of note. You can change the languages and you can uh, also put some subtitles on if we want. And maybe I have to forward, uh, fast forward a little bit here to see some subtitles running, but there you go. There's one up on screen now. So it looks like uh, Chromecasting here is working pretty nicely. Uh, on the Amazon Prime Video service, all is good. All right, so uh, let us now switch gears over to the Amazon Fire TV and see how YouTube works. All right, so I just fired up my Amazon Fire TV 4K stick, and because there hasn't been an official YouTube app, uh, there's been a lot of copycat things that have been on uh, the platform. So if you don't see the app front and center in the app page on your device, uh, do a search, and then what you want to look for is this icon. Uh, this app is the official one. Uh, so we're going to click on that and get that installed here real quick. And once that is done downloading, we'll pop it up and see what we can do with it. Uh, this will, of course, work with the Fire TV Stick 4K, which is what I have inside of my device. Uh, it also apparently will work with the second generation and basic edition Fire TVs, the Fire TV Cube, and some of the Fire TV televisions. So it should work across the board, and it also apparently has 4K support, and we'll find out because we have it hooked up to a 4K monitor here. I do need, though, to log into my YouTube account, so let me do that, and when we're done, we'll come back and see how it performs. All right, so I've got YouTube going here. We're running a 4K video at 60 frames per second right now. It did take a second for the resolution to spin up, but uh, all is good here at the moment. I did drop a few frames, but I think it dropped those frames as it was ramping up the resolution to play things back. Again, this is a Fire Stick 4K in the back of this, and all seems to be uh, good on that front. Uh, now, what I want to try next is to make sure that it recognizes my YouTube Premium account. Uh, that was an issue I had in the past, so we're going to go look up Cobra Kai and see if we can spin up that video. Okay, so now we've got Cobra Kai running here. I didn't get prompted to subscribe to uh, YouTube Premium. It looks like the full episode here is playing, so I think uh, all is good for my YouTube experience now. We've got the legit YouTube app now running on Fire TV, and I think that is a significant development here. Now, the app also supports the A word, so you can do voice searches while the app is loaded without having to request YouTube specifically. So I have the YouTube app up right now. I can just say, Metal Jesus Rocks, one of my favorite channels. And what'll happen here is it will go out and search for Metal Jesus Rocks and bring us to the search page. I can then click on his channel and then jump in and get things going there. So this is a great development to finally have a real YouTube app on the Fire Stick and other Fire TV devices. It's also great now to be able to do Chromecasting uh, to Google devices. If you had an NVIDIA Shield like I did, you were able to watch Prime Video all along, but now the rest of the Google Android TV ecosystem and Chromecast will be getting access to Prime Video. So this is all good news for us, and if you haven't yet downloaded this stuff, 
have at it. It is all working and ready to go for you. And this is great for consumers to have more choices of boxes that will play all of the content we want to see. Until next time, this is Lon Seidman. Thanks for watching. This channel is brought to you by the Lon.TV supporters, including Gold Level supporters, the Four Guys with Quarters podcast, Tom Albrecht, Brian Parker, and Kalyan Kumar. If you want to help the channel, you can by contributing as little as a dollar a month. Head over to lon.tv slash support to learn more. And don't forget to subscribe. Visit lon.tv slash s.